Okay, people, this is our late night snack. Today we didn't really do a dinner video because we just kept it simple with hot sausage, fried, fried onions, left it at that, you know. But we have shrimp with parsley, obey, garlic powder, and and cayenne pepper. And then you have your diced tomatoes already. You know the lettuce is about to be chopped up. And you have your tortilla wrap uh, papaya bread. And this is how we're toasting them down some so they can be nice and soft. Then the shrimp will be cooked down, sauteed. And that will be our shrimp wraps. The shrimps, we get the good shrimps that we have to devein ourselves. Devein it means you take the dookie line out. And um, these are going to be pretty good. Very tasty. Now, you have us. Well, I don't got to show you all the dressings, but we use blue cheese dressing. We use creamy Caesars because I know a lot of people don't know what that is. That's a spicy type dressing. And we use sweet and spicy French dressing. But, we, you know, it's up to you. Some people want ranch. Like I wish I had some ranch because I would put ranch on mine. But I'm going to settle for the blue cheese today. And, like I said, these are great. And it's a quick five minute dish not even that long and off to the races so y'all will see in a second uh the preparing of the shrimp as y'all can see the papaya bread is already coming out back to back done in the game yeah we keep our dish water fresh we wash dishes as we go that's how we keep the kitchen clean and make sure we don't have a whole bunch of pile up of dishes i had to do and as y'all see some more being done ones in her hand get ready to go in and people while i'm gonna have everybody on video i apologize that some of the videos have not made it to facebook y'all can blame facebook for that over one gigabyte will not download to facebook they say 15 minutes but it's really 10 minutes and our video has been longer than 10 minutes because we're giving y'all step by step of what we're doing so please like the pictures comment like y'all been doing i love it i appreciate it and Please go to YouTube. We'll keep sharing the YouTube link so y'all can easily find it and it'll stay fresh on the news feed. But please go to YouTube and comment, like, and watch and share the videos. Because I know y'all love what we do. And a few friends have been talking about us dealing with the TV show hosts like Steve Harvey and them. The people that have been helping different people that have this type of inspiration. To tell you the truth, we can't go to them. It has to be people that support what we do emailing them. And you don't need a lot of people just to email them. But honestly, the more the better. Start emailing Steve Harvey and all the rest of them if y'all really want the information on how to email them and stuff so that y'all can get good old Christina Marie Bullock on cooking TV in front of millions cooking and showing them what she do. I will help y'all with that so y'all know how to get the email to Steve Harvey and them. And if y'all want me to post it on Facebook, just put in the comment section because I believe this video is going to make it to Facebook because it's not going to be that long. As y'all can see, we're almost done. The shrimp is about to go in and it's pretty much over. But that's why the videos haven't been making to Facebook. It's Facebook fault. They say the video can be 15 minutes, but it really can be only 10 minutes. And it kind of sucks, but at the same time, it somewhat doesn't. And the reason I say it somewhat doesn't because... You can't really profit off of Facebook views. But YouTube, one thing about if y'all support us on YouTube, YouTube will pay us because of the movement we're starting. People, if you don't know, if y'all got silly kids that like to do silly stuff, start recording it and putting it on YouTube. When you get a thousand views, that's a thousand dollar check they send it to you. Why I struggle if you don't have to? I'm telling you people, there's a lot of ways out here to make money. If y'all want to know more ways about how to make money, you can get with my wife, Christina Marie Bullock, and she'll direct you to me or she'll deal with you to herself. Or you can come directly to me because a lot of y'all already are my friend, especially the people from Philly because y'all already personally know me. And I miss y'all very much. Yes, I do miss my city as much as I hate to admit it. I miss my good old crazy city because of the simple fact living out here in this country life, you got to have... There is limited access to the world, basically. And the type of business I'm in, I need access to the world, like literally within seconds. 
we live in a country and, you know, septa, <laughs> it runs from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. And it's done. Now you have your shrimp that's sauteing down. And that's pretty much the end of the process. Once these are done, they'll be incorporated on the pita bread. Then you have your lettuce chopped up. Then you already have your tomatoes. We have sour cream in the refrigerator. And like I said, as far as what salad dressing you want to put on there, it's to your liking. I prefer ranch or blue cheese, but it's up to you which one you want to use. Now you have the shrimp. And some people, they like to mix dressings, like my wife, she'll mix dressings. <laughs> Honestly, I love narrating, but I can't wait till she get her voice back because she's doing a lot of talking in the background, but y'all can't really hear her because her voice. And we just like to have fun in the kitchen. And people, like I constantly keep saying in these videos, do not be scared to step outside of your comfort zone with cooking. This is our first time making these shrimp wraps. A lot of stuff you may see in the near future will be our first time making, but you won't know it because of how good we are at doing it. That's part of being a creative. You have to, in order to be creative, you have to do something that never been done. That's called creativity. So, join the movement. Please hold for the end in preparation, which will be when they're prepared. Because the video is hitting seven minutes and I don't want it to go over ten. Yeah, I only paused. The, I literally only paused the video for about two seconds. Shrimp are done. Now they're about to be prepared. Now, as y'all can see, preparation for the wraps to be made. As you see, another step of the preparation being done. Secret to it all: we're putting dirty rice on before we put the shrimp on. Just so much flavor. Flavor Town. Okay, now your shrimp is added, and welcome to Flavor Town. Flavor, not flavor flakes, but flavor. You want this right? Yep. See mine with the ranch on it. You don't need a whole lot. You just really want to add flavor. That's all. You just want to add a little kick to it to complement the spice of the spicy shrimp. There you go. That's all the wraps made, complete. And people, God bless. Enjoy. It's pretty late, so I expect to probably wake up tomorrow at the noon and have 99,000 people to like and comment it because a lot of y'all probably are already off and resting. But God bless and good night. Thank you for experiencing yet another journey in our kitchen with us.